Always tracking, always alerting. This is Storm Team 8. Exceptional day today. Beautiful sunshine. Just one or two clouds in the sky. And if you're looking off to the east, you'll see the nearly full moon rising tonight pretty easily. It peaks on Saturday. Saturday is also when we start to see some increasing clouds, however. Tomorrow, up near 85, so still really mild. And most of us will stay completely dry. Just watch for an isolated chance of a shower late in the day. Sunday, again, starting mostly dry, but rain really develops in the afternoon to evening. Temperatures up near 78 degrees. So all in all, this weekend is not going to be overly rainy. We just have some time frames that you want to watch for a chance of a shower. Here's the next 24 hours. You can see temperatures dropping down to 62 for our overnight low, ramping back up into the low to mid 80s with cloud cover. And the best chance for a shower is going to be further to the south and east. That's even though our next system is very clearly off to our northwest. So here's why. This system is moving very slowly. As it does so, it's helping to draw in some moisture and cloud cover from the south and the southeast. So even before this line gets here, we could see a pop-up shower, especially on the east side of the state, for Saturday. Once the two systems combine, we see rain, especially Sunday night into Monday. Here we are, zoomed in, slowed down, starting off dry. Continuing on through Saturday, notice how dry it is, but a pop-up shower possible, especially the further east. By the time we finish out Saturday, the systems get closer to combination, and then continuing into Sunday, we see it actually happen. Sunday starting dry, rain showers developing, and then tracking from south to north across the region. Best chance of rain is going to be Sunday night into Monday, however, and you can see that reflected on the eight-day forecast. By Tuesday, we wrap up the rain, warm up a little, and then next week is looking really nice.